Parker. Jag tror han kom något på det. Okay, everybody, welcome back to uh, Catching a Buzz with your code. Today we have a unique solution. Um, perhaps you have a friend who has caught too much of a buzz with the cuz. Maybe it's you. Maybe you have a reason that you don't want to drink tonight. Budweiser has created Budweiser Zero just for you. This uh, 50 calories, no sugar, 11 and a half carbs, not too bad. Um, made from barley, rice, hops, and water. Pretty, uh, pretty neat, alcohol free. It's got a pretty cool looking can. You know, Budweiser has been in business since 1876. Uh, so they have a little bit of experience, whether you like them or not, um, I don't know. But uh, this is supposed to have the full Budweiser taste. It says so on the can and we believe it. We believe marketing claims until proven otherwise. So let's get this thing open. You know, maybe, uh, you know, I don't, I don't know why you would really seek out and start your night with, uh, you know, a zero alcohol beer. You know, maybe uh, you wanna have the experience and health benefits of a beer without all the cool side effects like lower inhibitions. Or maybe perhaps you don't like waking up with that hangover anymore. Or is nice. And you couldn't tell. At Thanksgiving, you could give this to your angry uncle when he refuses to stop drinking. Or aunt. Not bad. Definitely has a good beer flavor. And I know the big running joke, especially out of this country, is that uh, American beers don't have any alcohol in them anyway. So uh, this, um, if, you, if you like Budweiser, or even just any light beer, you can see it's really light, even though it has a full, a full beer flavor with no alcohol in here. Um, this would be a pretty good substitute. Let me tell you, if somebody's had a few, they would never, they wouldn't know that, notice the difference. Right? Why not? We look like we could chug these things. Not bad. No hangover. I'm, I'm, in fact, I'm actually hydrating right now. Taking all those relaxing benefits of the hops. And, uh, and the barley. Beer is supposed to be, uh, you know, a healthy drink. The alcohol is what kind of, you know, knocks that off the, the trail a little bit, but I think we got something here. You know, some other brands have, uh, you know, 0.0 .0 or really super low, like, you know, 0.5% alcohol. I don't know what the legality of this is. I don't know if you could drive around with this or not. Uh, I don't know if you have to be a certain age to buy it. I, I'm not a cop, I'm not a lawyer, I'm not a judge. So legally, I'm not gonna do anything to you. But uh, I, I would uh, try this if, you know, the standard disclaimer is if you're of legal drinking age or if there's no alcohol in here. So let me know in the comments. What do you think? Can you drink this? Can I drive around with this? I don't know. I'm not suggesting that you do it either. I probably wouldn't. But uh, 0, 0.0, why not? So we have uh, another video up here you know, that has uh, some of the other alcohol-free beers. It's gonna, be, uh, it's gonna be interesting. I think uh, a lot of people are kind of done with the hangovers, but still like the beer taste. Maybe this is a good uh, substitute. Maybe it's uh, Heineken or some of the other folks, but uh, try them. If you see it, buy it. What's, what's the worst that could happen? You don't like it? I like it, I think it's okay. So with that, uh, here's to not getting a buzz with your cuz today. And uh, we hope you have a great uh, afternoon. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel because we're gonna be going back to the high octane stuff pretty soon, probably the next video.
So we'll see you then.